Hi guys, I'm Liza with Lopez, registered holistic nutritionist and master trainer. And I'm gonna show you an awesome recipe today. It is for almond milk. Almonds are actually really, really healthy. When you purchase at the store, generally they are pasteurized. Whereas here, because it's raw, we get to keep all of that good stuff. First thing that you need to do, you wanna get a cup of almonds, put them into um, preferably like a glass or a ceramic bowl, and then you wanna cover it with one or two inches of water. I leave it um, room temperature, and then I'll use something like a cheesecloth or something just kind of breathable, and I'll leave it like that overnight for at least 12 hours, okay? Um, and then in the morning, you're gonna strain it, you're gonna rinse it off, and you're gonna end up with what I have here. I've pre-measured out my three cups of water and some Himalayan pink salt. So let's put our first ingredients into the blender. I'm gonna throw the almonds in. Bye bye. We're gonna throw our water in. Are you ready? I'm a little clumsy, so let's just hope it all goes in because there's no spout on this. Ooh, ready? Yeah. Okay, I'm proud of myself. And I'm not gonna use all this salt. I just wanted to show you how pink and pretty it was. I'm just gonna use about a pinch of it. Ah, perfect. Perfecto. So I'm putting this in. It's about to get noisy. Here we go. Woo! 45 seconds, guys. So now what I've got here, it's definitely got a lot of fiber in it, but I've got my nut bag. I know the name is a little funny, but I've got my nut bag here and I'm gonna pour all of this goodness into the nut bag. Here we go. I'm gonna pour it. Oh, oh, Liza, that is a messy person. I need them to come home with me and, and just do this with me. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're just squeezing. We're not gonna use the fiber, but you can hold on to this and it can be used for other recipes and if you subscribe to the channel below, you will be seeing a future bar using this, okay? Here we go again. Promise not to spill this time. So instead of adding sugar, we're gonna use medjool dates. So I've taken the pits out and I'm gonna take one of these, a little bit more vanilla, so I'm gonna toss that in whole. One more time, 45 seconds. Now, this nut milk will last you about three days in the fridge. I'm gonna have a glass of it. I don't know where my cup is, so. Thank you. <laughs> so, doesn't that look so good? Of course you need a pretty straw. It tastes Honestly, like it just doesn't compare to store bought ones. You can taste the almond. If you wanna make it a chocolate almond milk, you can just add a little bit of cocoa powder at the same time that you would add your vanilla and your medjool date, and then you've got chocolate almond milk. I hope you enjoyed that recipe. If you wanna see more recipes, any fitness routines, lifestyle stuff, please subscribe down below. Please like the video if you did enjoy it, and put your comments below if you got to try it, or if you just wanna say hello. I like to interact on social media, and I hope you guys have a great day. Peace out.